got a picture, got it's an expression for perimeter and area, and I've got express perimeter and area in terms of R and X, and then show something else. So to start off with perimeter, it's the whole way around the edge. I've got one R here and another R there, so that'll be two R. I've got one X and another X, so that'll be plus two X. And I've got plus a quarter off the whole circle, which is two pi R. So quarter times two pi R. So simplify that, so that'll be two R plus two X plus a half pi r and the area a equals a quarter of pi r squared plus this rectangle here the area of that rectangle which is rx good and now i've got to find hence show that a and this has got no x in there so i need to get rid of the x so from here there, work out what x is, we'll work out what 2x is, 2x would be p minus 2r minus half pi r, that's just taking this and this up to the other side, divide by 2 to get what x equals, that'll be uh, half p minus r minus a quarter pi r, and now I can put that x into this thing here, expression for a to get a equals a quarter pi r squared plus r times by this bit a half p minus r minus a quarter pi r multiply out the brackets quarter pi r squared minus a half r p minus r squared minus quarter pi r squared. So I've got quarter pi r squared and minus quarter pi r squared, that'll go. And that will leave me with a equals minus um, half, no it's not, that's not minus, it should be a plus, plus a half r p minus r squared. Uh, so don't need the plus in front of it. Good, that's what I wanted and or PR, RP. Uh, taking the perimeter of the cross section as fixed, so that means that's now a constant. So if I were to differentiate this, it won't, it won't affect things. Find X in terms of R for when the area is a cross section. So where the area is maximum. So DA by DR is a half P minus two R. And for stationary points, points that will equal zero. So half p minus two r equals zero. So two r equals a half p, and so r equals divided by the size by two. R equals. Well, I don't want r. I want p, don't I? Um, so p will equal times by size by two, four R. So we've got P is four R, and now show that for this value of X. Okay, so I've got to find X in terms of R. Well, I've got X here, I want to get rid of the P. Uh, so put P equals four R up into here, and that'll give me X equals a half of P, which will be two R, minus r minus a quarter pi r and so it says that x equals r minus a quarter pi r or x equals take out an r one minus uh, a quarter pi and that's what x is and show that it's a maximum not a minimum well that means i need to cut it in red that means i have to come from here and work out d to a by dr squared, which equals negative two, which is less than zero, which implies that it's a max. And that's what we've got. Uh, you could just seen actually, the answer I think may have taken out a four as well, uh, or quarter rather. So it might be a quarter r times four minus pi, but it's the same thing. And uh, that's done.